It's a day after Valentine's Day and you're still alone, you miserable fuck. You've been an insufferable cunt for a long time and it's high time somebody let you know. Nobody can stand to be around you and that's what Valentine's Day is about. It's about being around people that you love, people that make you feel good, and I hate to tell you, but you don't make anybody feel good, not even yourself. Every year, all the other secretaries go home with roses from their men and you go home ready for another night of drinking too much wine and crying into your pillow. And this doesn't just go for the women, the men too. Some of you suck and everybody knows it. You spend all day playing Call of Duty or whatever nerd game you play in between arguing with people on Facebook about QAnon or whether or not it was an insurrection. If it was an insurrection or it wasn't an insurrection, either way your dick didn't get wet on Valentine's Day and that's what the real problem is here. Nobody is looking for the man of their dreams in Facebook arguments. You are a lonely, miserable fuck for a reason. Might as well change it from just Black History Month to Black History Month and you're a miserable fuck month because that's what it is. But never fear because spring is right around the corner. And guess what happens in spring? You still don't get laid because you're the same miserable fuck you were through all of February. I'm not going to bullshit you. I'm not going to make it seem like this started on February 14th, 2021. You've been a miserable fuck for a long time. Nobody probably wanted to hang out with you for Christmas, New Year's, Thanksgiving. You probably couldn't even get laid on Halloween and you were wearing a mask that should be able to hide that ugly attitude of yours, but it didn't happen. So I'm not here to make you feel better. If you were alone on Valentine's Day, there was a reason for that. Maybe by next year you can get your shit together and somebody will actually love you. Anyway, this has been Ty Rivera, the absolute best LGBTQ comedian in the world. Happy President's Day. Mm -hmm.